just for our local heroes. I'm Chantal Belafonte, your neighborhood reporter in Hillsborough, and I spent the morning with some of our local first responders who are getting some extra special treatment at the new Bucky's that's set to open this weekend. Never thought Hillsborough would get anything like this. Greg Markwart, born and raised in Hillsborough, tells me he never expected a Bucky's to open up in his hometown. It's a big day for Hillsborough. One, I hope it brings jobs to Hillsborough for uh, everybody that, that uh, lives here. Uh, boost the economy for sure. You will get your chance to have your own Bucky's experience starting on Sunday. But on Friday, it was opening day for first responders as a thank you for their dedication and service to the community. All about getting, giving back to the community, uh, the community that helped us get here. These guys are out here on the streets, on the roads, protecting the citizens of the communities that we're in. And we just want to give them a thanks. While talking to firefighters, I met Brian Painter. He's an assistant chief at White Bluff Fire Department in Whitney. He says working as a firefighter isn't easy and it feels good to be thanked. We're trying to help out in the best way that we can and we're not getting paid for anything that we're doing as volunteers. This is one of the largest thank yous I've ever seen, a single gathering of first responders outside of an emergency in Hill County. So I'm just so glad that they've done this. Took the time to say thank you for these hardworking folks. Now that Bucky's is closer to him, Painter already has his eye on what to order when he stops by. I've had I think every type of jerky, but hot take, I'm going with the jalapeno honey. Again, this Bucky's will be open for the Monday morning commute, and there will be a grand opening and a ribbon cutting on Sunday at 1 p.m. I'm Shinsabu Lafonte, your neighborhood reporter in Hillsboro.